Let's go to the softball diamond now. The first round of the high school playoffs are in full swing. One El Paso team punched its ticket to the area round on Wednesday. The East Led Indians, a few more hoping to do so tonight. We'll start with game two of the by district series between Hanks and Jefferson. The Knights won big in game one, and they won big in game two as well. They're up 14 to nothing at this point already. Bats were on fire. A shot into right center. The run comes in to score to extend the Knights' lead. Later on, Alejandro Salazar up in another hit to right field. As two more runs come in, the Knights take a 23 to nothing win over Jefferson to advance to the area round. How about El Dorado and Burgess in game two of their series? El Dorado won over Burgess on Wednesday evening, playing an afternoon game. The Aztecs up big in this one in the fifth. Vanessa Solis has played a two run bomb over the center field wall as El Dorado wins 11 to 2 to advance to the area round. Uh, this is the first time in school history that they've won back to back by district championships. Re keep it on rolling. Canatillo and Chapin. The Huskies went undefeated in district play. Bottom of the first. Chapin down 2 0. Madeline Martinez. Single to right field. A run comes in. That was part of a three run frame in the inning for the Huskies. Bottom of the second now for Chapin. It'll be Jasmine Enriquez. Great contact. Not enough to get this one over the wall. However, falls in for extra bases. Triple, actually. A couple more runs come in. The Huskies come out with the 12 2 win over Canatillo in game one of that series. Game two scheduled for tomorrow at 5 p.m. Finally, some other scores from my district playoffs. Class 6A Americas losing to Abilene in game one. Pebble Hills, the same result in game one of their series as well. San Elizario shut out in their uh, game one of the Class 4A series. Fabians in a one game series versus Monahans falls 20 2. Their season is over. Not pictured in 3A is Anthony, which also lost any one game playoff to La Mesa tonight. The playoffs will continue tomorrow. That's your look at sports. We're right back after the break.